But, um, but, you know, you've talked quite a bit about cultural appropriation. This is something that I've thought about. Could be, maybe it's totally invalid. You can let me know here what you think about this. If they say, okay, gender is largely cultural, sociological, the two have kind of be become interchangeable now, certainly as we relate to the transgender community, it's culture, gender. Okay, then we have to acknowledge, we remove biology, let's say gender is, is cultural. There have been cultural norms like the Boy Scouts for men. They are Boy Scouts. So that was culturally ingrained, fine. But then how is it not cultural appropriation for women to say, by the way, we're now going in the Boy Scouts. Well, on, that's, that's a part of male culture and you're appropriating it. Well, I mean, it is a whole historical thing and it's the old argument that boys and girls need different things to mature. This comes a lot out of the increasing power of single mother culture. There is a, a single mother culture has a big problem if it turns out that boys need male role models and not the kind of fly by night guy sleeping on the couch because he can't date someone other than a single mother kind of guy, but a steady, dedicated father who's there, you know, protector and provider, all of that kind of good stuff. Now, if boys do need fathers in their lives, then single mother culture, the welfare state, all of that giant mess has been a massive disaster that has hugely harmed children. Now, Feminists say that women need role models. They need role models in, in science. Uh, well, how on earth could a woman figure out if she's supposed to be a scientist or allowed to be a scientist unless she sees 10 female scientists? They need mentorship, according to feminists. Women need mentorship in business. They need mentorship as girls. They need girls to show them the way and to show them what's possible. But then when it comes to boys, there's this weird blank that happens. It's like, okay, well, if girls need mentorship from mature adult females, don't boys need mentorship from mature adult males? Yeah. Now, of course, if we accept that they do, single mother culture, single mother subsidization through the welfare state has been a giant mistake that has perhaps irrevocably harmed generations of boys at the moment.